Yo, what is up YouTube? It's your boy Breezy Kicks, aka the Sneaker Fiend. Now today we got the LeBron 16 Atmos Safari colorway. These things are fire. Now before we get into the sneakers though, make sure you subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hit the little bell down below so you can stay notified of all my videos. I do sneaker reviews, on foot videos, sneaker customs, man. Anything to do with sneakers, so make sure you subscribe. Let's get it. Uh, most of the time when these people be talking, I don't even hear them. I don't. They talk and they talk, but I do not hear shit when I'm here. Looking at the box, it comes in your standard LeBron 16 box. On the side, you got that lion logo. Size 10, retail 175. Yeah, 175. So yeah, there's the box. 175 bucks. Can't go wrong with that price. Bam. So if you guys don't know already, these are inspired by the Nike Air Max Atmos. Easily one of the most hyped Air Max styles out there. Putting it on a LeBron 16. Looking at the upper, you guys see this elephant print. The leather is, it's nice. Nothing crazy though, but I really do like the elephant print. I think it is a dope ad. Easily my favorite part about the sneaker though is this material right here. Kind of a rough suede type material. I'm not 100% sure what the material is. You guys can just see how intense the quality is. These things are awesome. You have a green Nike logo, the exterior part of the shoe. You have an orange Nike logo. The heel does have the Nike swooshes, but on the right pair, you're gonna get this green logo with a orange outline and the exact opposite on the left pair. The lining on this sneaker is kind of different. It's kind of a one piece upper, but it does have this zipper that tightens it up as well as laces that really just run along the whole bottom. And then it'll just come up on each side and then you can also tie it at the top for more support. But for the most part, uh, I just rock them loose. Honestly, it felt more comfortable. The second you zipped it up, it was not uncomfortable at all, but it was uh, tight. It was a little tight. It was just something I didn't it was more comfortable to rock it like this honestly So if you unzip it, you will get a Nike Air Max. I think that is awesome You can zip it up Really different, but that's one thing I really like about sneakers is when they come with different stuff like this To be honest when it comes to the zipper I don't really think it's the best quality just kind of looking at it now when zipping it up I did find sometimes you pinch this little inside fabric part when trying to zip it up and it'll get stuck so i'm really hoping the zipper doesn't break that would just suck but then again like i said i'm just gonna rock it loose and like this anyway i think it looks better i think it's cool that you can show the nike logo you have a lebron signature on the inside insole is just a green insole with an orange nike swoosh i think it'd be dope if they came out with the high top 16. You know, something with the height of a 15, but on the 16 model, especially this colorway. Getting into the midsole, you have this cream type of color. It's almost like a clay. That's what it remind me of. You got your air unit that is on the 16s with the best part, the gum outsoles. These things are fire. I love gum outsoles. I think they look so good on a sneaker. Uh, I think they really did it right this time. So you got your crown logo and then the dunking logo on the heel. This whole shoe, I love the presentation. I'm loving the fit. I was kind of skeptical at first just because I don't wear too many low top sneakers. It's just not my style. I tend to go towards bulky shoes, you know, like LeBron 15s were like perfect for me. As far as pricing goes, you can still pick these up for a decent price on StockX. My predictions is they are only gonna go up from here on. So usually when sneakers come out, they'll sell out, the price will go up, and then by the time everyone gets their shoes delivered, the price drops super quick. That's where we're at right now. So if you want these, I, I honestly think you should pick them up right now. They're going for about 220, really is a dope price. You know, maybe 50 bucks over retail, which really isn't that bad. But like I said, my predictions are they are gonna go up. So if you want them, hop on them now. Again, I absolutely love the sneaker. I did wear this ASG 
Nike shirt to go with it today. I thought it was pretty dope. Thought I'd show you guys that. What do you guys think? What are your takes on it? Did you cop? Did you pass? Did you take the L? Would you buy it for resale? Comment that down below. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't done so already. It's your boy Breezy Kicks. It's good. Really bossing up now, pushing foreigners round the town. Girls just love when I'm around. I don't gotta make a sound. I can't hear a head of talk in the background at the lounge. I be up in VIP with my sneakers on the couch. My mama said that I'm a clown.